Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Uh, now in this video we will be proceeding ahead with another method, probability method or equal gain method from the game theory. Till now in our previous videos we have done uh, how to develop uh, payoff matrix and the two methods from X strategies we have done is odds method and dominance method. You can uh, concern my uh, previous videos for that. And prior to that, we have also done the saddle point method that is how to get the saddle point by max mini and mini max principle. So now let's proceed with this method that is probability method and or other name is equal gain method. Now this method is used when first thing there is no saddle point and the matrix is a square matrix. No saddle point means the, the players are using mixed strategies. So now this is basically used only for square matrix and uh, that is a 2 cross 2, 3 cross 3, 4 cross 4 but uh, we can't go more than 3 cross 3 because otherwise the question and the solution will be very tedious. So let's do, let's see how this uh, method works. So let us pose like uh, it is a mixed strategy. The player A has two strategy A1 and A2 and player B has again two strategies B1 and B2. So it means both the players are having two strategies player B is B1 and B2 and player A is A1 and B2. So now let us suppose the inside contents are this is A, this is B, this is C and this is D. Now A is let strategy A1 then the probability with the probability P. Let us suppose A's player select strategy A1 and the probability of that selection is P. So now total probability is 1. So what will be the strategy uh, probability for selecting strategy A2? 1 minus P. Similarly, if B selects B1 and the probability is Q, then for B2 it will be 1 minus Q. Right? So what will be the values? How we have to get the values for P and Q? Firstly, we need to get the strategies and now the strategies depends upon the probability. So firstly, what is the requirement? We need to get the value of P. We need to get the value of Q. And then lastly, what we need is value of K. So how we have to calculate uh, value of P and Q? Let us suppose if we say that player B selects B1. So now then A player then the payoff for that player X, uh, for that player A, what will be that? Payoff for if B selects B1, then payoff for A will be, or in random, in uh, layman I will say, to get the value of P, we have to equate two equations. We have to put them equal. Which two equations? It is A into, so for getting the value of P. So first my process is this. A into P plus C into 1 minus P will be equals to B into P plus D into 1 minus P. Clear? And for Q, how we have to get? If we solve it, we will be getting the value of P. I will be doing one question also. So it will be quite convenient for you to understand. And for Q, what will be that? So it is A into Q plus b into 1 minus q. So let's understand this way. Firstly for p what I have done a into p plus c into 1 minus p which is equal to what b into p plus d into 1 minus p. For a we are going a into p and this because we were doing with this is a payoff for b1 this is for b2. Now we have to get the value of Q. So how we have to go with this? A into Q plus B into 1 minus Q which will be equal to C into Q plus D into 1 minus Q. So from this we will be getting on solving the value of P and from this we will be getting the value of Q. Now what is left is the game of value of game. So to get the value of game so the formula is you can either go horizontally or go vertically but I will go vertically in this case. 
you can go by any method a into p plus c into 1 minus p so this payoff so this was what the probability b is with q so multiply the whole bracket with q plus b into p plus d into 1 minus p so this was with Mat this was with the value below for b2 is 1 minus q so you just solve this you will be able to get the value of k so let us implement these rules the probability method in one of the question of 2 cross 2 so here is a question so now what is given to you they have said that solve the following with the equal gains method or probability method. So now since it is quite mentioned that we have to proceed with that. So let us proceed with that. So let us suppose A selects A1 prob with probability P. So it will be with 1 minus P and this will be Q. This will be 1 minus Q. So I will be quickly moving to the solution with the simpler mathematical formula. So what I have told is this is the position of A, this is the position of B, this is C and this is D. So first equation to solve P. To solve P. So what we have to follow 1 into P plus 4 into 1 minus P will be equals to 5 into P plus 2 into 1 minus P. Clear? Next let's solve it first p plus 4 minus 4p equals to 5p plus 2 minus 2p so it will be 3p plus 2 i hope the screen is quite visible 4 minus 3p so let us let's get 2 goes this side 4 minus 2 it's 6p p comes out to be 2 over 6 that is 1 over 2 3 so let's see if there is some error or not right next so it means we have got what we have got is p value of p comes out to be 1 over 3 so p is in this place i will write 1 over 3 so now what will be the value of 1 minus p 1 minus 1 over 3 comes out to be 2 over 3 so 1 minus p is 2 over 3 so we got the probability for selecting strategy a1 is 1 over 3 and a2 is 2 over 3 so now we need to get the strategy for b so let's solve it to get to solve p to solve q Now to solve Q, how we have to deal it? So it is 1 into Q plus 5 into, so this process, this into this, this into this, then this into this and this into this. 1 into Q plus 5 into 1 minus Q equals to 4 into Q plus 2 it is a 2 right 2 into 1 minus q so quickly solve it so from here you will be getting the value of q as 5q equals to 3 uh, if i'm not getting wrong uh, it's 3 plus 2, 5, 5 minus 2 is 3. So, 5 minus Q, it's 4. Correction. I was sitting, there is some error. It is 4, 4 and 2, 6. Right. Q comes out to be 3 over 6, that is 1 over 2. So, you get the value of Q as 1 over 2. Now, let's put it there. So Q comes out to be 1 over 2. So 1 minus 1 over 2 will be 1 over 2. So what we have got? We have got the strategies. So let's list them. Strategies. 
strategy for a is p was a1 1 by 3 comma 2 by 3 and for player b comes out to be 1 by 2 comma 1 by 2 so we have clearly stated that a will follow this with the probability this now what we require is now the value of game value of game so how to get the value i have already told you the formula right if we select for this equations then we have to just multiply this by the product q and this by the product 1 minus q so let's apply this so it was 1p plus 4 into 1 minus p so now i will be using the complete p value of p as it is because since we have got that 1 by 3 and so let's use that so now it will be 1 into 1 by 3 plus 4 into 2 by 3 first this is for the value of game so it's 1 into 1 by 3 plus 4 into 2 by 3 this has to multiply by q1 a q q is 1 by 2 plus 5 into 1 by 3 plus 2 into 1 by 3 okay 5 into 1 by 3 plus 2 into 2 by 3 now this has to be multiplied by 1 by q 1 minus q so 1 minus q is again here coming out to be 1 by 2 so let's quickly fill up the 1 by 3 plus 8 over 3 so this is into 1 by 2 plus 5 over 3 plus 4 over 3 into 1 by 2 so quickly take the LCM 9 over 3 into 1 by 2 plus 9 over 3 into 1 by 2 so this comes out to be 3 3 is a 9 it's 3 over 2 plus 3 over 2 so net shell the value of game comes out to be 3 so value of game is 3 so this was one question with the probability method or you can say equal games method i hope it is quite clear if you need any assistance or tutoring you can message me or you can contact me on telegram also or instagram also thank you